Hello, Mick. How's it going, bud? Good. How are you? Mick, tell us why the Grave Diggers here is such a good bun of Guinness. Because the Guinness is poured so fresh, he pours all the pints on the bar and they're not left, as they settle naturally. There's about 20 pints in the bar all the time. And that's what you need for Guinness. You need a good steady flow, clean pipes, and the Guinness is so smooth and it tastes wonderful. And the brewery is just over across the river. Is it? And it comes straight from there over to here and there's always a constant flow. That's what's important about the Guinness in Dublin. Everyone, everyone says this is the place. Oh, it is this place. This place is brilliant. I come here regularly. Brilliant. Best place for Guinness in Ireland. Brilliant. brilliant. Yeah, amazing. Well, we've definitely so gone to the right place then. Oh, definitely. Enjoy it, man. Enjoy we'll, it. We'll see you at the bar. Yeah, big time. I'll, I'll get you a pint. Either. I'll get <laughs> you a pint. Well, we'll have, I think we'll have a couple. See you later, Nice to meet you, my friend. Ladies and gents, welcome to Food Review Club. You, as you may have twigged, we are in Dublin and we've come to the Grave Diggers. We did a Guinness review somewhere else last time we came and there was, there was uproar. You can't have a Guinness there. You know, people are very protective of this sort of stuff. So today we've come to Mount Everest for a few pints of the black stuff. We've got a couple of special guests on the inside as well. And it is a very special day as well. It's St. Patrick's Day. So we've come to the best pub on the best day in the best city with the best people to have the best drink. Is it, show me a better Friday. You can't. You ready, Are you gonna have a pint of Guinness, Gunner? I'll have a pint, yeah. Ladies and gents, come, let's do it. That's a cracking dog. Whoa. That's a very nice dog. <laughs> Get in quick before it comes. Ah, oh, nice one. These dogs. Hey, nice dogs. <laughs> <laughs> Do I want them? Oh, it's busy. Holy oh, shit, look at this. Look at this. Do you see that? Billy just got around him. Who is this? Who is this guy? Here you go, mate. I'll take pub fees. <laughs> dark air from here, isn't it? Yeah. Look at the floor coming. Yeah. Very old school. <laughs> Cheers. Here we go, Marlon. Happy St. Patrick's Day, guys. Happy St. Patrick's Day. Enjoy every minute of this, Billy. What about your self size? Yeah, get him in. Cheers. Cheers. Who's got his? Who got his? Hello. Uh, here we go. See the glass, the way it sticks to the glass. That's the stick. <coughs> That's the sign of the right. point. I wouldn't. I wouldn't necessarily know a great one if I had it, but it's nice and creamy, cold, and stick it to the glass. Cold, creamy. It's beautiful. Hang on. It goes down nice. <laughs> Billy, what are you saying? <coughs> Top of the cream. Delicious. So smooth. Sit down, sweet. Simon, what do you think about the pub? Sick, mate. It's got kind of like an old school saloon with like the sliding doors and. Yeah, it's cool, mate. Very old. Yeah, the proper old. Uh, the wooden shutters up, like little compartments in the same room. Mad atmosphere, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. And the Guinness is banging. <laughs> it's good, isn't it? Yeah. Some, not some places like this, just. <laughs> they carry their own legend, don't they? <laughs> not moving like, from this spot. This feels. <laughs> 300 years old, doesn't it? I feel like we've gone back in time. Yeah. <laughs> Travel. Yeah, you see everything. Best seat in the house. That's good, boys. And it's near the toilet, so you Yeah. This is where the real people are. Oh, yeah, the Irish, the lads, the Irish lads. The culture, the community. That's it. That's why we came, everyone kept telling us, and then you go there, and then you go there. Best the, dig the diggers. He's, a, he's only been here 10 minutes. Yeah, I know. The Gravers. The Gravers. He didn't send loads of us yet. Cheers, Slodger. 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 Nice to meet you, Slodger. 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 Slodger.
Oh, Sloger. 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 Oh, don't bang it too. Don't bang the flags too. <laughs> <laughs> That's Smithy Tales, a very good ale. And that's your tipple. Yeah, not, not the Guinness. Guinness. Oh, I hate Guinness. Really? You hate yeah. Guinness? You hate Guinness. Yeah. What, what makes that better than the Guinness? It's a little lighter. More lighter. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Well, the Guinness is fairly heavy, it's like a medicine. If you're in here and you play some sounds, some, uh, you know, people might play on their phone. And then uh, the, the barman might say, give out and then um, and, and throw you out and bury you. Bar, 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 anybody that plays music. Built in 1843, just a year after the graveyard cemetery. So we had the graveyard is 1842. Just one year after. Travellers, John Travellers, seven generations of travellers. You know? yeah. What time are you going to be here till? Close? No, no. No? Probably eight, eight o'clock tonight. What time did you get here? I'm oh, here when it opens. When they open? <laughs> Half twelve. Nice. Typical lawyers. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Feliz, old school. Hello, mate. Happy Bloody's Day. Wow, what a what is an historic pub, and uh, what a fantastic pint of Guinness that was. Was it worth the the wait, the anticipation of of it? I think I think it might have been. I've never been anywhere like that in all my uh, all my life. And was it indeed the best one of Guinness I've ever had? Yeah, absolutely. Ooh. That is the. Uh, I've only had a few. Well. You've had quite a few. I've had quite a few now, yeah. Um, brilliant. Loved it. No TV, no radio. Felt very felt nice. Cool. Yeah, it felt really cool. And yeah, it definitely had that sort of vibe and magic about it. It's very hard to give me a, a, a pint of Guinness a score. Can we? <laughs> I don't know. We're not Guinness at all. It was a good Guinness. The best. See us, Big Daddy B. Pugs and Matt on a mission to find who's got the fastest, freshest food in the kitchen. Different places, different flavors, try different things. Who's the ruler of ribs? Where's the winner of wings? Who's the king of kebabs? Where's the boss of the burger?